when we do this, I'm gonna push that face. You're gonna take it down, tap. When you come up, push your hips forward. You try to squeeze into your glutes as hard as you can. All right, so you're gonna do 30 of them, three zero. First round, we're gonna have it together. We're gonna go down, tap, squeeze. So you're gonna go into a deadlift, you're gonna go as low as you can, and then you're gonna squeeze your butt as hard as you can. This is starting to wear. I know you guys don't really care about the time, so I don't know why I tell you every day. Whatever. If you saw my last video, um, one, I hope those tips helped you, and two, if you saw the end, you know I have a lot to get done this morning. Like, I got the video edited, posted, we're good there, and then I have the CPR and AED class at 9, and it's kind of a little far away, so I have to leave here probably in a couple minutes, and... It's from 9 to noon. Lord knows I get hungry, so I'm going to bring a little snack with me. So I have to stop by the store really quick. I'm going to make some coffee to go. I'm going to use my, my Saturday's chocolate donut because it's my favorite. I did order two of the messy buns because they got back in stock. And those should probably be here tomorrow. So I'll definitely let you know my thoughts on that when I get those. I have been using the Frey Tinted Moisturizer kind of as like, well I use it as my moisturizer and then it's kind of like the base for my um, powder I use. And I've been loving it because I have like the winter paleness has already started. It's whatever. But I feel like it gives me a nice little glow. So I've been loving it. And I did put a little powder on today. And a little bronzing powder. But that's basically all I do. I put the tinted moisturizer on. Most days I just do the tinted moisturizer because it evens out my skin tone. And you guys know I don't like wearing a lot of makeup. So that is like perfect for me. Um, because it does make me feel a little bit more confident with not having makeup on. And I can wear it to the gym and not worry about it like breaking me out or anything. Because it's made for people who sweat. <sighs> okay. I need to make my coffee. Then we're going to go to the CPR AED class. I need to bring a little book. Take some notes. 
everyone says it's super easy. I was certified like forever ago when I worked at Lifetime. I worked in the child care center, but I just haven't taken the class in a long time. And I think you have to renew it every two years or something like that. I don't know. So need to get ready to go to that. And then hopefully we get my rental car today. <laughs> it was so stupid. They're like, oh, well, you needed to call and make an appointment. I'm like, you guys knew I was coming. Like you made the appointment, but whatever. And then she was like, well, see, we're in kind of a pickle because you're under 25. You can't drive a truck or van. You basically can't drive anything other than a sedan. And I'm like, do you want to like poke your head outside and see the massive truck I've been driving? And not to mention when I got slammed into by someone else, I was driving my SUV, but whatever. I was so irritated. I was like, okay, so now we've been to Enterprise twice, wasting so much time, and then we have to go back today. This whole experience is just very annoying, but hopefully we'll get the rental car today. We're gonna start getting everything together for New Jersey. It's gonna be a good time. Let's get into the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the hamstring glute workout. The only thing I didn't record was we started off with hamstrings, superset with a big lap of lunges and calf raises that was like our warm-up and then we got into that sumo squat and then well i guess it was like a deadlift no more like a squat and then we did narrow deadlift so yeah i think i showed you everything else we did These are the best cookies ever. Oh, hi. Hi. Hello. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, I'm coming, Bio. I'm coming, Bio. Hi. Finally got my rental car. Definitely not what I would have liked, but I think I already told you guys at the beginning of the video that under people under 25 aren't allowed to have really anything other than a sedan. So I have a Ford Focus, I think they said. I don't know. It's okay. It's just small, and I'm so used to having, especially after like I went from my dad's huge truck to this tiny little car and I'm used to driving an SUV as it is. And even when I had my old car, there was still like a lot more headroom and I had a sunroof which made it seem a little bit bigger. So I'm a little claustrophobic in it right now. I probably sound like a diva. I'm not trying to be, I'm just being honest. It's a little, it's a little tight and the brakes are like super touchy but I'll get used to it. My dad did call me though and I guess the insurance company like the guy whose fault it was, their insurance company met with the body shop guy that where we took my car and they, <laughs> there was $13,000 worth of damage to my car. That's how hard he hit us. So, sucks for their insurance company, um, but hopefully I'll have my car back in like two weeks. Hopefully they were gonna order the parts today. So, anyways. At least I have a rental car now. My dad can have his truck back. I did bring the muffin pan back. I didn't stop at Kroger though because I didn't really feel like spending money. I think have these little cuparoos. So that's one thing. What else? The, the thing that we might have a problem. I don't think I have baking soda. Definitely don't baking soda and I think I need that so maybe we'll make like pumpkin waffles <laughs> uh, I don't feel like buying something I don't know <laughs> let me look around and we'll see what I can find that is it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed it as usual I'm ending the video like the day you're watching this um, I just finished up at the gym got my smoothie in my little teeny car, like my bun. <laughs> I 
I feel like I'm just like gonna get squashed, but that's fine. We'll get used to it. It's okay. I just like big cars. Anyone else who agrees with me, comment down below. Like, is it just me? I don't know why. I do not feel safe in little cars. But thankfully, this is like a full size, so it's pretty, pretty long. It literally looks like a wagon, kinda. My dad said it doesn't, I think it does. But at least, at least I have a lot of room behind me. All right, I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. And I might have to like pre-record a video to post on Friday. There most likely won't be a video on Saturday. Definitely not Sunday. Cause I'm gonna be gone, I'm gonna be in New York. So, if you have any video ideas, comment down below. Or I guess I can look in yesterday's video. I think you guys commented down there. Um, but yeah, I will pre-record. Maybe I could do like my fall favorites. I don't know, I'll do something. I will see you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Every turn I take, every trail I track, every path I make, every road leads.